Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Gonzi and today we are going to be reacting to the first part of Ed and Rose from 90 Day Fiancé. Probably the most famous couple out of 90 Day Fiancé that I know of. So without further ado, let's start this thing, man. Let's go. I'm Ed. I'm 54 Ed. years old. People know me as Big Ed. I'm from San Diego, California. And I am a professional photographer. Oh my God, right there. Right there, beautiful. That's perfect. Oh my God. I actually gave myself Mop dog. the name Big Ed. Why are you giving yourself your own nickname, bro? That's like LeBron James calling himself Chosen One or King. Steph Curry came out and said, Yeah, Chef Curry, I name myself that still. Don't give yourself a nickname. Perfect. That's lame. Because I have a huge lame personality and it makes me feel tall. That's the money. <laughs> nice. Also, it's funny because I'm not tall. I'm actually 4'11". Hilarious. Not in heels. I'm kidding. <laughs> no. My height is something that I'm very self-conscious of. But it's something that He's I've been cute, able know. to overcome because I'm Big Ed. You guys are great. Oh, okay. Thanks again. Thanks again. You're welcome. You guys that are awesome. cute. <laughs> My girlfriend is Rose Marie. She's 23 years old and she lives in the Philippines. One day I'm online on social media. I'm scrolling through. What's the video? How old is this cretin again? She's 20. He's 54. She's 23, dude. What are you doing with a 23 year old? That's wrong on so many levels. Easy math. Half your age plus seven. Yeah? 54. Split that in half. 27. Plus seven. Yeah? You don't even need to add the seven, bro. Bro, just the fact that it gets 27, half your age, you are not meant to be dating a 23-year-old. You're just not. And if you are, it's wrong. Pagan. My girlfriend is Rose Marie. She's 23 years old, and she lives in the Philippines. <laughs> One day, I'm online on social media. I'm scrolling through, adding friends, and I come across Rose Marie's picture, and I'm like, oh, my God. I sent her a friend request. She accepted me. And we became friends about three months ago. She has the most amazing deep brown eyes. I was like, wow, I'm in love. <laughs> Good night, my king. Oh my God. Talking to Rose has become the best part of my day. Oh, cool. So I said, look, will you be my girlfriend? Her response was, sure, I'll be your queen. And what do you mean, bro? You are already dating. You have never met each other. At least meet once, bro. You can be my king. <laughs> Every morning, the first thing she does when she wakes up is she sends me a photograph. I don't have a connection like this with anyone. <laughs> you excited to see Granny? Hold on, little monkey. I'm leaving in six days Poor for doggo. the Philippines to meet the girl of my dreams. I can't wait to be face to face with Rose. I can't wait. But I do feel somewhat conflicted because I'm getting a lot of pushback from my friends and family. Of course you are, you lunatic. Of course you are. Listen to them. Oh, hey, mom. How are you Hi, doing? Hi, Pony. How are you? Pony? <laughs> so, mom, I needed to nah, um, ask you if you can watch Teddy Wong go to the Philippines. His Why mom calls him Pony. Are you serious Hell about no. Rose or what? Well, I'm very serious about Rose. <laughs> it's not funny. She called him I'm Pony. I'm concerned That's mad. for you because you don't really, really know her. Mom, I hear what you're saying, but I love her. I already Ow. bought a ring. <laughs> it's not no. love, it's lust. No, no, no. What do you mean Take you bought back. a ring, bro? Have you spoken to Tiffany about how she feels about all this situation? I can't. She won't talk to me. Who's Tiffany? Tiffany's my daughter, and we've been so close all of her life. She's 29 years old. We are pretty much two peas in a pod. She's older than you. She is just she's like her father. She's your daughter. And she's the best thing that I have created on this earth. How I think she's he... somewhat embarrassed 
that of course, bro. that I'm want to marry somebody that is younger than she is. I really think that she's genuinely concerned about you going out there. Bro cannot be that desperate. Surely. Mom, Mom I just want to be happy for once. <laughs> Since I met Rose, I, I want to look young for her. So I have been dyeing my hair and it irritates my scalp. So I found out that mayonnaise makes it smoother and less dry. This pony yeah. is putting mayo in his dumb head. Stop putting mayo in your head and stop using some brain cells, bro. I'm self-conscious of your my brain physical cells, appearance. Dude. Because Rose no. is 31 years younger than me. Fucking hell. I smell like an egg salad sandwich. No shit, Charlie. But it really, really works. I just want to look young for Rose. Fucking hell. I look good. I'm good. What the fuck am I watching? Hi, my queen. Okay, I'm, I'm my queen. I'm gonna be there in a week. I'm I'm flying six thousand miles. Shh. Three planes. Oh, and my bed so far. The cringe. Hey, is Prince there? Can I say hi to Prince? Say hi. Hi, Prince. Hi, Daddy. Oh, okay. Rosemary She's, is a single mom, she, she's a mom of a four-year-old boy named Prince. It feels too soon for Prince to be calling me Daddy, but at the same time, you know, Prince is part of the package. I'm excited to... He should be calling you Granddad, bro. Are you mad? Come and see you. Me too, you know, it's Don't be nervous. I'm more nervous than you are. What if you see me and you run away? <laughs> I'll be a smart thing to do. I don't know what I think. <laughs> what do you mean you don't know what you think? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I'm very playful with Rose, it makes me uncomfortable that Rose has so many friends online I have maybe a thousand friends, and she has almost four thousand, and that gives me a lot of concern. You, I'm just—I worry. I mean, you. Let's see you know, why do you have so many friends on Facebook? Facebook? I wonder you if, she knows 4, if you, you talk to them like Brainless you talk to me. Moron. You know, you. And I'm also worried about your ex-boyfriend. Is he there? What? Do you, do you, can you hear me okay? Oh. Oh, the feet cut out. Oh, just your in screen time. froze. And she's gone. Great. So I kind of started to ask Rosemary about why she has so many friends online and the ex boyfriend, and then um, I suddenly lose, you I know, internet connection. Myself. So okay. I did this to myself. I don't know if that's. A coincidence. I clicked play. It makes me question the minute, you know, I start talking about those things, she kind of disappears. I mean, kind of, bro. The message is pretty Rose clear. Rose is very evasive when I talk about her past. She's not a Pokemon. She shuts down. She doesn't want to talk about it. And that, that bothers me. Based on this conversation tonight, you know, I'm going to ask that she take an STD test. If I'm going to make this level okay. of commitment, I need to know that she is being honest. Dear Lord, have mercy on my poor soul. What the fuck did I just watch? I have no, I, I legit have no words. It's legit trying to marry a girl that is 31 years younger than him. It was already bad, but as soon as you know, his daughter is 29. You're like, brother. Hell no! Hell no! Yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching the video, man. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like the video if you want more of this, you want part two and everything like that. All glory to God as always. Subscribe to the channel, all that good stuff.
and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.